Welcome back everybody, we are here to finish Keira's quest and yes, uh, we found the place where her goods were passing and of course there are going to be some drowners. So we will examine and investigate all of this and we will try to find where her package ended. Wide heavy wheels, a merchant's wagon. And they were going this way, so it means what? Let's let's go this way. Hmm. Okay. We have some kind of random letter. Of course, it has to go into the woods. Wait a second. Whatever. It's not important. Let's go and... Did they even stop here? I don't think so. How far did they go? Yeah, merchant traveling across Velen alone. No way that was gonna end well. Well, why is it in this state? Why did they have to break it human from an artery can't be far wouldn't have made it hmm we will see that, that. Overs, cuts of meat cataplepus wonder what spell requires that package still intact don't sense anything magic though wonder how Kira will explain this one <laughs> hid and waited for help never came that's Velen for you And the letter... Okay, we have everything now and we can head back to Kara. So I will see you when I get back to her and yeah, we will find out what kind of package did this guy transport for her. Now that we came back to Kara, well, let's go and ask her a few questions. Might be something interesting, who knows. Let's see. Just when I was starting to miss you. Yeah, right. Got those uh, substances you wanted. Splendid. I can finally begin my study of double arboreal racination patterns. But first, I'll. Brew yourself a mug of mulled wine. Saw what the wagon was carrying exquisite meats, expensive wines, Zeracanian spices. Not a speck of magic. Care to tell me what you're up to? I would rather show you. But you have to wait a bit. <laughs> uh huh, okay. Fine, I'll wait. <laughs> then shoo outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable. Really? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, go on, out. Why do I need to go outside? You've been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. Almost ready? The whole day passed. If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Note that I said almost. Now don't interrupt. The cane And they are humans. Oh, horses. Okay. Yeah, what happened to the third mouse? <laughs> third mouse? What happened to it? The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. I always use one more than I need, just in case. So where did... Kira, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm-hmm. True story it's based on, too. A zoogle cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole. Left behind one slipper, so... I beg you, not another word about zoogles. <laughs> now to return to the fairy tale. I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't need a fairy godmother, I'll cast the spells myself. But I could use a Prince Charming. It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Velen. So, <laughs> really? what do you say to a moonlight ride on horseback? And dinner? <clears throat> Uh, 
Well, yeah, let's go. Sounds tempting. So tempting, I don't think I can refuse. Before we go, there's one more thing. Gotta transform a pumpkin into a carriage? No. <laughs> I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will return to normal. Okay. Why not? Might as well go all out. Then hold on tight. Gavella Glan. So, what do you think? Neckline too modest? It's just right. Oh, I might also have changed your hair color while I was at it. I've always fancied dark haired men. Oh well, <laughs> caught in a storm. <laughs> well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Last one there does the dishes. Okay. Well, you know what? <coughs> Women are for dishes, so yeah, I'm going to win the race. Because uh, I assume that Geralt does not know how to wash dishes. <coughs> it might be also a big problem, considering all of that. And we are pretty close. Or we just might be. It seems it's a little bit further than I thought. Mm. No, 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 no. I need to win. I'm not letting you. <laughs> Do you really say nearby and... I mean, look how far it is. No, 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 no. Yes, I'm the winner. <laughs> I don't want to do dishes. <laughs> Congratulations, you'd make an excellent jockey. If only I were a foot shorter and five stone lighter. <laughs> well, yes, but then I'd not have invited you here. Now do you see why I needed those substances? Mm. <laughs> I don't. Could have just told me what this was about, right now. <laughs> Geralt, run to the woods and fetch my shopping. I'd like to make dinner. Well, would you have helped? If I'd known I'd get a glass of Zubaran dry in return, of course. Well, well, never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think witchers suck the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with puddle water? More or less. Well, we've chatted long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Must have cost you a small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cock or gander there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. Okay. How, if you don't mind my asking? I mean, you'd think the only work to be had in Velen would be in farming. <laughs> Very true. So, I've two options. I can either start cultivating turnips or leave. But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. Not the first <laughs> I know I was. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that island? Why I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. Well, you didn't say that at first. Mm. Uh, why are you even interested? Because I grasp the importance of the studies conducted there. In the wrong hands, the findings could do immense harm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Romantic? Thought we came here as friends. Friends. With benefits. Oh! So... <laughs> oh! Ho -ho. Um... Well, you know what? We're going to go with the most interesting endings in every single one of these dates. So, uh, the first choice... 
Your fairy tale, your rules. Really? Then close your eyes and count to ten. Well, she will One, disappear. Two, no. No, three, open your eyes. Four. All right, that's enough. I knew it. I knew it. Kira, we men. Wanna play hide and seek? Why not? Hide and seek? How old are you? Okay, I have your smell and by the density, it is Good. pretty Won't strong. Have to with fasteners. Good. Won't have to fumble with fasteners. Oh come on! I was trying to collect this thing. No! Why did the smell leave? Okay. Hmm. Shame. Could have kept her shoes on. Or maybe not. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's just go down. Now where's that Cinderella gone to? I think we should have brought the shoes so she can wear it. You know, the thing to make sure that it is her. Know what they call that constellation in Zeracania? Well, we had to skip this scene because of YouTube, but okay. Who played, well, they know what happened. Lean closer and I'll whisper it in your ear. And now I will forget everything. I'm 100% sure. 100% sure that I forgot Kira, everything. Where? Or she just put, put me, me to sleep. sleep. Spell means she's up to something. No. Oh, okay. <sighs> Fike Isle, the tower. Again? Really? How many times? Just how many times? And give me back my armor. Um, oh, it's going to be another quest? Yes, it's another quest. Okay. Well, uh, <laughs> in the next episode we are continuing with Keira. I thought we are finally done, but we are not. So, see you in the next episode.